Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video guys. Today we're going to be talking about the new Twisted Realm um, challenge and the new event which is called the Energy Amplifier Initiation. Okay, so I already showed how to do the Act 1 and everything within it. Of course, I didn't finish it completely. There's a bunch of other stuff here that you could do and I should probably do them. Anyways, we're just going to talk about why this event is incredible why it's so fun how good of a job they did anyways we're just gonna talk about this real quick why this is so good is because it's difficult yes it is difficult especially for me i'm not the <laughs> smartest when it comes to resources because i keep like spreading too thin anyways so i need to really focus on improving and this is a great way to tell where i'm at in the game if i can't complete this while I'm AR50, there is a problem, you know? So I'm going to be focusing a lot on character building and stuff just so I can try to build the absolute best team to get um, this stuff done. Because this, this is difficult. And I'll show you why if you just go in without no preparation, without anything, you just click start and you try to go in, you will not win. All right, so let's say you, um, you decide, okay, I'm going to be smart about this. I'm going to use units that are going to freeze them. I'm like, okay, feel free. Go ahead. Try to freeze them. It will not work in your favor. Just because of all the debuffs, the weird things that go on in this. And I feel like that is enough to make this a difficult challenge. So, let's just get into it. Look at this, I do barely any damage to them. And look at the floor, if you can see that. Um, it shows... Um, like the floor like moving. Uh, that is basically a buff for them, or like it... I guess it's a type of ley line. And it's super annoying. And you literally can't beat it, look. It just... It, it just does that. I mean, you can revive yourself, but if you, I'm already getting beaten up at this stage, uh, <laughs> there is there is no point. So yes, this is a very difficult challenge, and if you're free to play, pl I don't I, I don't know what to say. You got to be very smart with how you use your resources uh, in order for you to be able to complete this challenge because. I completely humiliated myself there. <laughs> um, but yeah, very fun challenge. Excellent job by Mihoyo. This is just the first thing, right? There is also more challenges, more stuff to come. And of course, there is the difficulty. I mean, you can set it to easy. I don't know if how you know good this would make it. You know, you get 1600 for this only. But yeah. Let's try this on easy with the characters I'm used to. In the field and let's see if we can actually beat it on easy. With all those debuffs, of course. So we gotta beat it in under 180, the pyro resistance, or whatever. And all that stuff. Right. Let's start it. So they're level, level 40. This should be very easy, actually. I take almost no damage. But yeah, easy is legitimately easy. So, I mean, that's good. Uh, <laughs> kind of what you want if, uh, if you are playing easy. <laughs> um, but yeah, this shouldn't be too bad. Just the expert mode is very difficult. And you're going to have to put a lot of time into the game if you want to try to beat expert mode. Or just put the resources in the right areas. You can't just really use your resources everywhere like I did so make sure you just use your resources properly and you'll be able to beat this um, pretty okay pretty easy um, I think I recommend using a freeze composition for this so if you guys want to build some sort of team just for this a freeze composition is not a bad idea to start anyways I should probably start somewhat building a freeze comp team not exactly fully put all my resources in it, but just enough to beat to this challenge. Because I don't, I don't really care for a freeze composition. Uh, I just really want to beat this. Alright. 
easy as you like so easy is pretty easy <laughs> as you can see super super easy um so we're just gonna up the difficulty by one to see how we can manage with this very scuffed team so yeah let's just try this okay so we do get a 60 prima gem reward just for doing it on easy mode and we get 500 of the fractured data stuff um, i'm not sure how much exactly i have but i should be able to get diona just from doing this on easy mode you send invitation and diona is in your party easy as that just, just nice you got free diona from the very first day just completing the absolute just the least amount of things so very nice perfect that is how to get diona anyways we're just going to continue on we're going to do the normal difficulty with everything maxed out and see how difficult this challenge all right level 60 so these should be easy as well but we still have to finish this within the time limit provided in order for us to get the you know, most amount of points oh um excuse me could you uh just uh, stand there for a minute as i absolutely pummel you to the ends of the earth and be nice all right all right and i couldn't beat it in 180 seconds which is unfortunate um but i'm pretty sure i could still beat it just normally like that and the challenge is done Unlucky because I couldn't beat it in uh, under 180 seconds. Free to play damage. <laughs> but, but yeah. There it is. Twisted Realm. And claim your combined score attained. Which is pretty nice. And then after you do that, after you do all of these, you just try out all the possible things. And you go to the event shop, you can see you can get 60 Primo Gems up to 5 times, which is 300. And then you can get, you can get the Crown of Insight as well. You can get some Mora. The Mora is what I'm looking forward to the most. As well as the Hero Wits, of course. Uh, other than that, I'm not really looking forward to much else. Because I can just get these normally. Um, but the Crown is exciting. This is exciting. And yeah, I'm just going to grind this out, see what I can do. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that like button. That'd be great. I appreciate it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.